So, this is one of our friends here in Bonduelle. Could you introduce yourself, sir? Richard Lukasik. Okay, and uh, what did you think of the presentation tonight? Very good. That's and I had a lot to say. Yes, you did. Now, if you could say one thing to the federal government and your officials, what would you want to say, that, say to them? Not too much government. Thank you very much, sir. Too much taxes. Wisconsin. Okay, Cecilia. So, um, what did you think of the presentation tonight? It was very informative, yeah. Okay. Very, very interesting. Learned a lot I didn't know okay. about, about a lot of things, about the Constitution. Very good. And uh, if you could say one thing to the federal government, what would you like to tell your elected officials? Well, I would say they just got to clean up all the way around. The government is totally corrupt. That's all I've got to say about them, and we have no faith in them whatsoever at this point. But there, and there is hope. I hope out there. We need people who, who with integrity, who will run for office. Thank you very much. You're welcome, ma'am. Would you like to say hi? Hi, I'm Carol Fluteman. I'm from rural Bonduel. Uh, I really enjoyed the presentation. I thought it was very informative. Thank you very much. And if you could tell your elected officials one thing, what would you like to say to them? I wish so much corruption hadn't entered into the government. Um, and I think it's time we start getting our liberties back. Thank you very much, ma'am. That last one is a difficult one. So, what, first introduce yourself. Okay. I'm Bill Thede. Um, new commander of the uh, Zernike Wagner Post 217 at Bonwell, Wisconsin. Congratulations. Thank you. I oh. was invited to the uh, presentation this evening, which was well given. Thank you. Now, if you could tell your elected officials, whatever you wanted to tell your elected officials, what would you want to say to them personally? Um, I, I, I suppose it would be that they uh, abide by our Constitution a little bit more than by their own rules. That's perfect. Thank you very much, sir. Introduce yourself. Hi, 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 sir. I'm uh, Rodney Hoppe from Bible, Wisconsin. Okay. And uh, what did you think of our presentation tonight? I um, thought it was very informative. I think that everyone in America should see this in some way, shape, or form. Um, and I think our young people need to really see it to hopefully straighten it out by the time the next generation goes through. <laughs> Very good. Now, if you could tell the, your elected officials in Washington one thing, what would you like to say to them? I think that the government needs to be given back to the people the way it was meant to be in the first place. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah. Thanks for coming down and all your... And I guess to the federal government, yeah, we should go back to the to the Constitution. We're, we're gradually moving away from it. It's, I wouldn't want to live in any other country. It's still my favorite country. But I don't think we've got a lot of blessings, but I do think we're big. I, I know I'm, I know that we're losing some of our freedoms. And yeah, it's, of course, it's especially difficult in wartime. That's always been that way. War or depressions or anything. You know, you look back at what happened in Germany after the First World War and things were bad and Hitler promised a change and well it wasn't the kind of change they wanted and that's still the danger now. Uh, you can go down that slippery slope. Go down the slippery slope, yeah. So it, it's it's a real concern. I'm glad you guys are doing what you're doing because it's, it's a real danger and we've got something worth protecting here. Yes we do. Yeah. Thank you very much sir. Yeah. Thanks for coming down and God, God bless. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Well, there, well let me think. Federal government officials should read the Constitution and follow it because they are not. Okay, and what did you think of the presentation tonight? Well, it's getting other people informed about what the Constitution is about. So many people have uh, uh, neglected to study it. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Um, what, what, other, what, what do you think of our choices for president this year? What choices? <laughs> Great answer. Thank you very much for coming down, sir.